welcome back for another edition of Books Poetry with Miss Chavis. And today we're looking at the red-eyed tree frog that we looked at yesterday. And we talked a little bit about what it looks like. And I showed you a picture of what that red-eyed group, that red-eyed tree frog looks like. And we said that he has these huge eyeballs that look like tomatoes. He catches flies, his orange toes, he loves to pose, matchstick legs, hatches from eggs, swallows bugs, and lives on t-shirts and coffee mugs. And that's what we talked about, Save the Rainforest. Did you find a place where you could see the red-eyed tree frog? Me too. It was a very cool picture. I would love to see you share them, yes. Thank you very much. So today, I want you to read the poem with me, and we're gonna talk a little bit more about it. All right, ready? Red-eyed tree frog, tomato eyes, catches flies, orange toes, loves to pose, matchstick legs, hatches from eggs, swallows bugs, lives on t-shirts and coffee mugs. Very cool. So I also wanna look at this poem and I wanna see what rhymes because it's a very short poem. There's not a lot to it, but yet there is. There's a lot of things that you could tie in to this poem. So let's look. Eyes and flies. Does that rhyme? Yes, it does. What about toes and poes? Yes, it does again. Legs and eggs, of course. And bugs and mugs. Ah, I think that's probably why they said catches flies and swallows bugs, because we knew he ate up here, but swallow bugs rhymes with coffee mugs. So I think they said lives on t-shirt and coffee mugs and then went back and said, oh, I gotta add something. So swallows bugs. And I think that's how she got, the person got to rhyme those two things. So that we have this, that each, each, sorry, each stanza has rhyming words that run at it, the end of the lines. So something else I would like to look at today are some of those vowel teams. We've got some that we really don't see very often. In line two, this IE, we don't see very often, but yet it is a vowel team. Okay, do you see another one? Oh, O-E. Now pose has O-S-E and toes has O-E-S. So does pose have a vowel team? No, it doesn't. Matchstick legs, hatches from eggs, swallows bugs, lives on t-shirts, there's the, my IR, and coffee mugs. E double E always says E, you're right. So what I would like for you to do is go back and let's have a look this picture, the one we looked at yesterday, and see. What I would like you to do is see if you can find more pictures of the red-eyed tree frog and illustrate it on your page. You could make a poster or a t-shirt design that says something about save the red-eyed tree forest a frog, or you could say save the rainforest. You could design a mug, or you could just draw an illustration. I want you to take one of those three ideas and add it. Let me show you where. Do you go back here? What I would like for you to do is over here on the side. Could you design a t-shirt? because it says lives on t-shirts. Could you design a t-shirt that has the red-eyed tree frog on it and save the rainforest? Or could you design a mug, a mug that might say something about that? Or just draw a picture of the red-eyed tree frog in his natural habitat. Where do you think they live? Well, let's look at that title. Red-eyed tree frog. There's a hint, where does it live? right here and there is even a foul team right there 
So where do you think he lives? In a tree. In a tree. So I encourage you to find out more about how you can save the rainforest and how you could find the red-eyed tree frog. Maybe even visit one in real life. Thank you for joining me and we'll see you next time. Bye.